about this map. Also, is it? It's just interesting that I thought everything was randomized. Oh, oh, is this it? Is this? Oh, oh, going in between the walls. And welcome to GT Not Live, where you are joining us in media res. That is fancy talk for in the middle of the action. Thank you, 8th grade language arts class, <laughs> for that one. Right? Oh my gosh, look at all these boxes that I could pickpocket if I had a lockpick. Oh wait, I don't even need to. They weren't even locked. Oh, yes! Uh, we didn't want to waste anyone's time by, you know, starting at floor zero again. However, at the same time, Ash lost all the progress that they had done while I was off camera. <laughs> so we're not starting as far <laughs> as we originally intended. The game's like, hey, you've been idle, bro. Yeah. Get, get, go, go play this game or GTFO. And Ash was like, no. Yeah, Roblox was basically like, hey, suffer. And I was like, oh, okay, cool, sorry, while well, I was doing tech checks and... Yeah, yeah forgive me, I was doing my job! <laughs> but I did, however, um, beforehand, I got us some revives, so we don't have to worry about that. That's um, fantastic, thank Elsplash you. Splash also put out a code um, to get a free revive and some knobs. So I put that in, we got an extra revive. Oh, and wait, really? Yeah, so it was Sweet. super cool. Shout out Elsplash. Um, what, why was that? Oh, there was just like some, it looks like there was some glitches in the game, uh -huh. um, including the one you died to last Yeah, I, time. I saw that that was, I, I watched everyone's kind of commentary on that one, because I suspected that that is what had happened. So, for those of you who don't know, um, last time I got to floor like 78, or room 78, and was was crushing it. Like, we were, we were on a roll, man. It was a good run. <laughs> yeah, but, it was uh, pretty great. But uh, all of a sudden, halt... Uh, which is the one that makes you go back and forth. Oh my god! I, I meant to look. Shoot. I meant to look. I, I knew. I'm like, oh, I gotta pay attention to the door numbers. 28. All right. But anyway, Halt, which is the one that makes you go back and forth a bunch of times before you escape. Uh, there was a dark room in front of me. I got kind of nervous and scared of it, so I backed into the room that I was coming from. 29. And Halt Good. ended up spawning in front of me. In, in the room that I was supposed to have been leaving, which left me in a room where I couldn't escape. Hence why I ended up dying. And then we timed out of everything. And so it was, it was a bummer way to end a really strong run. So now we're in the process of, you know, trying to get back there, basically. Yeah. So we'll see. Oh, oh not, not great. Okay. Am I standing? Am I, am I fully standing in this one? This way. Ooh. That was tough. Okay, there we go. The game really does oh, look like shoot. astronomically Please, like, better. Right, doesn't it look amazing? Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Go, 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 go. Okay. Boom, baby! What is that? 35? 35. I gotta pay attention to the door numbers now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm not making this mistake again. Cam of man! All right, so Ash, Hi. you. Granted, we're not seeing really the fruits of, of your labor at this point, 36. Um, <laughs> sorry, I'm just going to be randomly shouting numbers at this point as, I, as I'm as i paranoid about the decoy doors. Sure. Um, so you got to play the game for a couple minutes. Yeah. That was exciting. How was it? It was so exciting. It was really fun. Um, I was like, oh, I'll be fine because I've watched Matt play this a million times. Uh -huh. I a was, million, literally a million mil times. Literally a million times. I was horrified. I was so scared. Wait, wait, really? Yeah. Well, I was all alone, so there was no one to banter with. <laughs> and <laughs> I was just, like, alone with banter my Banter makes a big difference, doesn't it? It does. Uh -huh. It really does. Um, but, you know, you're nervous about Screech, and then the lights flicker a little bit, and it's like, is this, like, a rush flicker uh -huh. or, like, a let's be spooky um, flicker? Right. And it was really... I was on edge. Yep. I was on edge. How far did you get? I got to, like, door 40. Hey, 40? Not yeah. bad. Thank you. And, then, and, and and you died through no fault of your own, so even better. Yeah. 
So, so really, you could have kept going. I, I could have, but I was about to encounter Seek. Oh, um, yeah. And I, mm -mm, mm -mm. no, not so much. You weren't, you weren't, you weren't ready for that one. Yeah, I wasn't. So maybe it wasn't door forty, but I remember it being close to forty. I was gonna say if if you were meeting up with Seek, you probably were close at that point. Yeah. So. Or you will have gone through at least one. Thirty-nine. I was like, I got through the Seek door, um, and then I paused it, and I was like, nope. Got you. I got you. A little sniffy, a little sniffy octopus man. <laughs> sniffy. I don't know. I don't... <laughs> strikes me, he strikes me as he has the sniffles. I don't know why. He has the sniffles. He's Maybe got... he has seasonal allergies, Matt. There's See, a lot of keep dust your in seasonal here. affective disorder away from me. <laughs> that's a very different I, thing. I know. Actually, yeah, that's I know. a very <laughs> different thing. <laughs> <laughs> She sees a friend, 41. Uh-oh. It'd be, it be a flickering. <laughs> it really do. I actually want to loop back to something you said earlier. Yes. Um, eighth grade language arts. Yes. I think that the vocab words that you're given between grades six and eight have a major impact on how you turn out. Ooh, okay, okay. Well, that, that's just a theory. A new theory. 42, okay. Tell me about that. Well, I don't know, because I feel like those are the vocab words that you remember, like, most. Oh, sure. Because, you know, well, they don't give you a lot of vocab words, I feel like, once you get to high school. At least in my experience, okay. they kind of fell off of that after, yeah. like, English 1 or ninth grade. They're like, you know you know as much language as you need to know. They're like, read a book, dummy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Absorb <laughs> linguistics. <laughs> but, you know, when you get, like, a vocab list in sixth grade. Sure. And it's more than, like four syllables mm -hmm. you're just like well, okay oh man now now i'm getting mature now and those are the words that stick with you i also think that the words that you study when you do like spelling bees if you ever did that also has that same effect of like you're you can pull those words more often when you're older um but it's just like everyone got different vocab lists uh -huh. so we're all pulling from this very specific like <laughs> list in our brain that's of, amazing i don't know did you have a did you have a, a go-to because because you're right sixth grade was the grade where they started introducing for me at least vocab as a standard thing that you were tested on and it was part of your like daily routine right yes we're at, and and that was also when we started doing sat word flash words yup yup and so yep. i was doing those sat word flash words and i i still yeah i mean to the to this day when i use a a word flash word or one that was like part of that you know list i still think of it as like oh that's that's an sat word it's like oh i feel so smart you know <laughs> I was like oh yeah it's like oh yeah pulling up the big guns like subterranean was a big one for me really subterranean was subterranean a interesting okay eponymous Ooh, eponymous um, that's a good one right i like that one um i have to think about which other ones were were big but oh yeah like certain words like that where it's like you still you say them today and yeah. you still get that sense of like ah huh, i'm using I, smart words i know that yeah that, that's i i studied you know yeah <laughs> did you have did you have like a specific book that you were operating off of because ours was Ooh. sat word flash and it was like these are the top you know 100 200 words whatever that show up on the sat or whatever no so in my school um at least my my schools i guess sure because i moved around um, but they had like, they had these pieces of printer paper, they'd get like cut into thirds. Um, and sometimes you could find your vocab like list buddy to yeah. see if your pieces of paper line up with each other. Oh, that's the adorable. way they were cut. That's so cute. Um, and they just wrote it out in like Arial or Comic Sans font. Oh, I hope it was Comic that. Sans. Yeah. All I, the best word flash words coming from Comic Sans. So true. So true. Um, yeah, then I take that. I get a different color pen. Write it down. Write down the words. Yeah. How many times? Because apparently, if you write down, write it down in different ink colors, it's easier to remember. Um, I had to write. I had to make myself little songs to remember. Oh words, yeah. But yeah. Um. Anyway, that's that's cool. My my theory. You're worthy. You're worthy. Oh wait, what are you doing over here? Oh damn. Oh damn. Oh damn. <laughs> oh damn. Oh damn. <laughs> oh damn. Oh no! <laughs> no! Shoot! Oh poop! It cannot see. I he he went to my section. That's my secret section, Ash. His I, I'm patterning so sorry. has moved. So okay, that confirms what I was suspicious of before, which is that he can go. 
in almost any direction in the, at this point. Because before he had his very set pattern. And now he can... Hopefully we'll not... Okay. Okay. Comment idea. Yes. Comment opportunity. Ooh, comment opportunity. So I need you guys to comment um, the vocab word that you randomly remember most vividly from sure. your school words or any, like school vocab words, or whatever grade. Um, comment that, or you could tweet it and hashtag GT Live it. That's a skill you might want to remember for the future. Wink wonk. <laughs> wink wink wonk. <laughs> Winky dinky do. Ooh, I like that one. The winky dink. Winky dinky do. Wink wonk. Wink wonk. Where you be at? Where you be at, home slice? I lost all my lock picks, etc. Oh no. It is a blow. And etc. Yeah. That's brutal, man. Right. It do be like that. It really truly do. It doest. Uh. I'm trying to think of word flash words. I think learning the um I think learning like word cells so valuable. Word cells? Yeah, like uh you know where you're learning like the the prefixes and suffixes and oh, you know the yeah. the makings of other words like how you fuse them together. Yes. Like you said subterranean like sub under ter ground, you know, earth all that good stuff. Like that that's game changing right there. That that is a game changer. That is. <laughs> that is that is shaking things up. You're like, I don't I don't need to look up anything. Yeah. I'm a god amongst words. <laughs> Word god. I can sound out anything. Otherwise known as a deity. From Dei, which means God. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> T, which means entity witch. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Word flash! You just got word flash! <laughs> Booyah! Booyaka! <laughs> got you! <laughs> Winker dinker do! <laughs> That's amazing. Winker dinker. <laughs> not as good. <laughs> not, not, not as catchy. <laughs> okay, he's over there. The old winker dinker. The old winkity dink. <laughs> Where you at? Where you at, book? Where you at, book? Ha. Got him. Okay. Love this song. It's, it's a bop. Peak bop. <laughs> it is a banger. This is on my Spotify playlist. Really? Well, you know, the OST is available. Yeah, is Where it? you stream, yes. <laughs> This is, this is my this is my study music. Yes, we should be Spotify friends. <laughs> oh, my gosh. We could do the blend. Ooh. You know that you know about the blend. I don't. Please teach me. Okay, oh, so hold you. Up. Sorry, he be, he be thumping. Dude, you are so good. He be thumping. You say that, I literally <laughs> died, in a very stupid, dumb way. Mere minutes prior to this, and now he be thumping. It's important to remember that you did what you could with the information you had at the time. It, it, it is true, actually. <laughs> I, I had no idea what was going on in that moment. I'm like, oh, my safe straps clearly have failed me in this moment. Okay, let's see how we're doing. Yeah, teach me about Spotify. Yes, the blend. So you can do this thing where you have, like, you take a friend and you guys, will you send them a link? and they'll hit that link. Uh -huh. And what it will do, it will take like your music and their music and it'll push it together and make a playlist inspired by both of your tastes. So it'll show the songs that you guys have in common, yep. um, songs that you've listened to that also match theirs, like, and that kind of thing. Uh -huh. So it's the ultimate like bestie playlist That's, mashup. Oh my gosh, I'll totally be your bestie. Yes! Oh, I'm so excited. Playlist besties! <laughs> When our powers combine, <laughs> we will have a nice variety of music! It's, it'll be an interesting playlist. It will. Okay, let's do this. Nine, five, zero, nine, five, zero, six, five, nine, five, zero, six, five. 
Nine five zero six five. Okay. Stomp, 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 stomp. Stomp, 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 stomp. Stomp, 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 stomp. Nine five zero six five. Stomp, 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 stomp. I'm angry. You found all the books. Angry stomping. Six. Five. Woo! Get up on out of here! Boom! <laughs> Slam that door! <laughs> Roll that beautiful bean footage! All right. Nice. Excellent. Okay. 52! Yeah! Yes! It's my favorite bros! El, El Goblino. Goblino! Woo! El Goblino! Hey, bud! Oh, that macho meat dude came in here a while ago. Almost destroyed the place. Oof, man. Macho meat dude? Do we know who the macho meat the dude macho is? Macho meat dude. Um, maybe, maybe the, maybe it's figure. Right? It must be. There's no other like entities in this game that are I would consider con I would say like are composed of meat. Yeah, like ve very meaty man. I wouldn't necessarily call the figure macho though. <laughs> I mean, when I think of macho and peak masculinity, I'm thinking more like Gaston and not like. <laughs> large mouth of teeth attached to like uh, inflatable tube man arms. <laughs> that's that's me. <laughs> this, well, is my, this is me at the club. Uh, oh, is it? This hold, is it. Hold <laughs> on. <laughs> this is it. Me at the club. <laughs> this is me doing my macho dance. That, you know, fair. This is it. <laughs> attracted, attracted all the eyeballs. <laughs> Didn't necessarily say in a good way. But attracting them. <laughs> this is peak masculinity. Peak. This is it. Look upon my masculinity and tremble. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a beard today. You uh, do. Testosterone be flowing hard. <laughs> it be flowing. <laughs> Woo! Welcome. All right, let's 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 play the game. <laughs> oh, people call me small. Nah, man. When I spawned in, I was much smaller. <laughs> cool, man. Cool, cool story, bro. <laughs> Great, I love this guy. El Coblino, what a champ. Can you do anything? There's gotta be an achievement for interacting with this guy, right? Nothing happens. How many times do I have to do it to get the achievement? Let's, let's be honest. We all know it's there. We all know something's gonna happen. You don't, you don't just include a random skeleton that you interact with and nothing happens. The game that I'm playing in my spare time is called Tunic. It's like Legend of Zelda, but harder. Um, original Legend of Zelda. I've seen a weird creature, dude. Looked like Seek, but purple and weird. Hmm. Purple and weird, like Seek. Interesting. Getting lore! Um, I think we've talked enough. Okay. Um, but it's one of those things where... Uh, it's a, it's a game all about, it's basically the original Legend of Zelda, but with, with like Dark Souls in combat. Uh, the puzzles are like incredibly uh, obtuse. Uh, it's great. You have to, you, your main collectible are bits of a manual that you have to kind of like unearth and figure out what they're trying to tell you through all these codes and stuff. It's really cool. Um, but anyway, long story short, uh, when it comes to, you know, it's one of those things where like at, you, it requires a lot of your gamer senses to figure out like I know something's here and I know this manual's trying to tell me something but what is it? Same thing with this. It's like I know something's here. The game's trying to tell me something. My gamer senses are tingling. Like years of playing games are telling me something here but I don't know. Maybe at some point. Okay. So I should pick up the key because the key got us something last time. Yep. Lockpick? Cross? What do you think, Ash? Okay. So we definitely need the crucifix. Okay, we definitely need the crucifix. Yes. Okay. Um, I would say, well, how much is the pills? Pills? 50. Let's just get all of it. Yeah, you think so? I don't, to my understanding, there is not a need to spend more money after this point. Really? Okay. That being said, I don't have a whole lot of need for the pills. Just because the pills make you fast and I am historically, speed is not particularly my friend in this game. There we go. I paid you. I paid you everything. I've given you everything that I have. All right. There we go. Jeff's shop. Who's Bob? He keeps saying, ask Bob. But this isn't Bob. This is Jeff. This is Jeff's shop. Is Bob this guy? I think that's Bob. That this has Bob. to be Bob. Right? 
Bob, tell me about it, man. Tell me about this this purple Seek character. I'm curious. <laughs> Nothing. All right. 80, 53. Let's move on. Let's move forward. Okay, so yeah, there's no other uh, cause to like loot and stuff? To, to I guess looting gets you items, but... My understanding. Okay, good to know. Okay, this is back half. Hopefully this time we can actually get through or at least you know, see what happens. Mm -hmm. But, uh, oh my gosh, SAT, I'm trying to think of like classic <laughs> SAT. Now, now you got me thinking about SAT word flash words. Steph and I have been talking a lot about like, because right now, for those of you who don't know, it's it's that time of the year. <laughs> why, why would you know? Uh, it's that time of the year for parents to like be figuring out like where their child should go to school. And I mean, let me, let me tell you, the like game of schooling is crazy. But mm. we just got done with um, observing Ollie's class for a little bit. And oh, wait, hold on. This is this is a fake one, isn't it? Oh, Ooh. I was paying attention. I swear I was paying attention. What was it, Ash? <laughs> you know, I I trusted that you had that information on lock. Oh man. Ooh. You're just showing me where the key is. Is that what what this is? It does say fifty five on the key. I feel like I should trust the key. That's just the blue sparkle of truth. But both of them say key 55. So I feel like the key might be leading us to the answer. This will be interesting to see if the, the key is actually misleading us. Miskeeding. Miskeeding us. Ooh. Yeah, that's 56. Yeah. So let's try 55. Just because that's what I, my guess was anyway, but also the key's telling us it's 55? Yeah, okay. Woo. So now we know... Bump. Was that rush coming or was that just stuff clunking? I think it's just falling just to fall. Yeah. Ambiance. 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 See, that's a fake door right there. I know that. Because we just went through door 55, game! It's unless, time for 56! Unless every door is now 55, which would be a great, like, mind trip. See, now that. That. Boo! Whoosh. Well, woo doo doo woo doo doo All right. But, uh, anyway... Yes. We, we were observing Ollie's class, mm -hmm. and we're you know trying to figure out like what 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 school does he go to now and this and that. But it's so interesting as a parent to like go in and watch kids like working in their class and stuff. It's such a you don't realize as a parent how removed you are from that like massive part of your kid's life, and you're always constantly at at the mercy of whatever they choose to tell you. Yep. yep. And so you're just working out in a black box. And so you're like, hey, what you do to sc at school? Like, I don't know. I don't remember. And then even if you ask specific questions, it's like, yeah, I don't remember. It's like, bud, you, you can fill us in. It's okay, man. And then we, we ask and we ask and we ask. And eventually you get like one nugget of information. 61. It's like, it's so funny because I remember being in the back seat of like my mom's car yeah. and her asking me about my day and me being like, it was good. It's not 61. I don't know. Uh -huh. Because right. it's like, once a kid is out of school, like, please don't make me think about school again. Right. No, it's, and it's so interesting because, <laughs> uh, you know, uh, Ollie, Ollie, again, is four. And so, <laughs> and so it's one of those things, dear diary, please let my kid talk to me. I, I know this is door 60. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> the game's trying to trick me. Um... But yeah, he's four, right? It's like that starts at such an early age of don't don't talk to me about this. I don't want to tell you. It's so interesting, especially because we're always like we talk about our days and what we've done, and nope, nothing. It's like nope, hard pass. Yeah, it's so interesting to me. But but yeah, as so now we just finished observing his class, which was very interesting and educational. But it's the same thing of like. I didn't know that you were doing this, but it's cool that I get to see you doing this. Yeah. You know, and even if you write to the teacher, they kind of fill you in on some stuff, but it's 
It's fascinating. Oh, look at you. You're, you're spelling X, Y, and Z. That's cool. And what they do at home is always different than what they do at school. And, and yep. you're able to do different things in different contexts. 61. That's the other thing that's really interesting to me is the idea of like different contexts, like performance in different contexts. Like if you look at this, the research that exists out there, there is so much to be said for kids do better in some contexts than others. I mean, we did the Among Us episode that talked about like, yeah, in if you're presented with, if the, the Among Us, if you're <laughs> presented with a red pen, you're going to do worse on a test because the red pen is, is psychologically like basically psyching you out in a lot of ways, which again, just so wild to think that yeah. something as simple as that can affect things. Or even like Ollie as, as part of this, you know, the, the whole school figuring out like what school he goes to process. Some schools like require you to, you know, audition for lack of like do, do an assessment, right? So they can see like where he's at and what, what he knows, what he doesn't know, thing, all that good stuff. But again, how that is set up like we've been to some schools that are like you know do all the right things with kids you get down on their level you talk to them you explain what's going on in simple language mm -hmm. you know you let them take their time but then we go to this other one and it's like literally like okay say goodbye to your mom let me drag you i'm a stranger let me drag you to this other building where in this place that you've never been to before and it's like, yeah, and you expect the kid to be able to perform? Then they're four! Again, they're four. It, it's a four-year-old, sir. Right? Yeah. Excuse me, please. Four. It's just wild. It's it's so interesting to see on one hand, you know, as a parent, it's like, you know, kids are able and have access to so many more educational tools than I ever had, you know? Yeah. Which is... Oh, hey. So, hello. <laughs> Hello, hello, floating friend. Uh, hey, fella. Yeah, so many more educational tools than. Oh, hello, yes, hi. <laughs> he's oh like God, needy. He's like he's like giving me ASMR in my ear right now. He's like, hey, hey, let's talk ASMR. Um, oh my gosh, what what do you want? What do you want, guy? Um, yeah, on one hand, you have so many more like educational opportunities and and educational videos and stuff out there and this and that, but they're also like. There's just such a high expectation for kids so early these days. Like, hey, yeah. can, can we make sure that we're still kids? Like, here's the thing, right? It's like being weirdly exclusionary about four-year-olds trying to go to, like, freaking kindergarten. Yeah, right? Well, it's like they're going to school to learn. Right. Right? Oh, yeah. No, it's, yeah, yeah. It's you, have like, to, you have to practice your... Oh, wait, wait, what? What the heck? Oh! So it seems that you uh, crucified him. Oh yeah. <laughs> Without even a, was was there even a a cue for him? He came out of nowhere. Um, I must have missed it. I guess. I don't know, but it that did save your life. It did. That was clutch. That was that was crucial. And now I'm like, oh geez. Oh man. Oh man, the back half of this game gets gets feisty in a hurry. 66, it sure 65, does. and 65. Great. Cool. Whoo. Whoo, buddy. That was intense. That crucifix, man. It, I, yeah. I like that one. <laughs> that's a good one. That's a, that's a winner right there. I want I uh, one more of those, please. <laughs> one more of your finest crucifix, please. Please. Oh, that's what she's having. But yeah, anyway, no, it's <laughs> Woo, Ex on nice. me. Ooh, and a lighter, no less. Oh, and all the pills. And, ooh, all the pills and all the lock picks. Pills and picks. Pills, pills and picks, baby. Yeah, getting those pills and picks. Woo! Load me up. Living the life. Love this painting. Artwork. Yes. But anyways, the problems with education in our society. But yeah, let's talk about education <laughs> in, in modern society. No, but, it, right? It's, it's just like, wow. You know, I didn't need to know all this stuff as a kid. Like, oh, use your school grip and be able to do X, Y, and Z. So, okay, here we go. Here we are at the infirmary. So, Ash. Yes. Fill Ash. me in. Yes. If you're allowed to fill me in. Are you allowed to fill me in on this? Uh, Is there a secret room? I saw people online talking about a secret room when I was looking at our our previous playthrough. And people are like, oh, there's a secret room in this one room. 
Yes. Um, so, from my understanding, this secret room leads to rooms. Rooms, plural, big plural. Okay, l like a lot of rooms? Yes. Okay. So, do I, um... How do I get to them? Slash, should I be getting to them? Slash, is this a moot point? I feel like that might be something we do after getting to door 100. Wait, it, really? It would set you back. It seems like oh a my, long... What? what? A long adventure, so... Oh, really? Yeah. So it's like a whole separate thing. It appears that way, yes. Cool! That's very exciting. So, it's I'm, on our radar, I'm just very so everyone excited knows. About that. Okay, we'll but, do, let's get to 100 first. Yeah. Okay, good Good goals. Can I use my key here? Should I be saving this key since you seem to know secrets? Since I seem to know secrets? Um, this seems like a good place to use a key in the room. Yeah, just use the key there for now. <laughs> I don't know if there's a leader. If I use the key now, there's no key for later. Oh, look at all this casual love. Oh, let me get that green herb! The healing herb. My heart beats stronger now! Eucalyptus. Stronger than yesterday! Terminal. I don't like that there's a painting called Terminal in the infirmary. <laughs> That's true. That's not great. <laughs> Six to seven. Ooh, it, Eyeballs. In the dark. That is not a painting. Ooh. I have, this is random, but yes. I want to tell you. Okay, tell me. I have the best business idea ever. Um, so have you, did you see the previous SNL with Pedro Pascal? Hold up, I got, I have a buddy. There you go. Uh, did I, I, I saw the preview. Ah, okay. 69, but I have not seen the SNL because, oh no, oh no. I, I don't tend to regularly watch SNL. That is fair. <laughs> Just that's saying. fair. Um, it's all over my TikTok. Um, but that's because Pedro Pascal is kind of taking over TikTok. Is he? He's getting these I mean, huge like fan cam edits. Okay. Um, a lot of thirst traps for him. Sure. Understandable. Um, he's, a, he's, he's a man with a palpable thirst. <laughs> so someone should trap him with that thirst. <laughs> someone should quit. Please slake that man's thirst. I like that the interpretation I, is that he's the one that's thirsty. Yeah, his thirst trap, man. He's laying out all those traps. Oh my gosh, Slake it's like when Afton hasn't had enough to drink. Yeah, please slake with your diary. I'm thirsty, please slake it. Love, Matt Pat. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Pedro Pascal bond that way. <laughs> yes, I know what a thirst trap is. So okay, just, okay. I'm playing dumb here. I'm not yes. that I'm dumb. Not that dumb. You're not dumb. No. You did what you could with the information you had at the time. No, so... um. That's really big on TikTok right now, and there was this really, really popular one. So I'm assuming he did well. Also, I, I find it amusing that uh, that SNL, one of the like oldest and also most derided at this point, I feel like comedy brands out there in a lot yeah. of ways is is thriving on SNL. <laughs> this is news to me. This yeah. Is a, this is a, this is interesting news to me. They did this one skit where this teacher is having like I don't know some kind of like class or assembly or something. Okay. Um, and he's confronting the students about why they're making fan cams about him. <laughs> really? So <laughs> wow, look at them being all... <laughs> <laughs> and they're just playing fan cams? That's pretty fantastic, actually. <laughs> so here's my idea. Okay, wait, I gotta focus on this for a second. Okay, so... Otherwise I'm gonna die, which would be a bummer. Right after this commercial break. Yeah. Brought to you. Oh, geez. Oh, no. Ooh. Wasn't the smoothest of starts to this run, I will say. Oh. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Ow. Unnecessary. What number is that? Seventy-eight. Seventy-eight. Slam. Slam a jamma. He'd be angry now. Hello! Alright, 78, made it! Woo! Woo! 79! Doing fine! 79, doing fine! Number 80! See a lady! <laughs> It'd be flicker in. 81. 82? No thanks. 
This is that guy. Ambush. Whoa! Okay. That was that was scary. The addition of uh, the guy, or like the the greater prevalence of the guy that kicks you out of the closet makes those encounters so intense cuz you're really judging whether or not you think you can you should stay in the closet or if he's going to bounce back fast 84 it is it is incredibly tense look for 85 okay 85 so anyway, please continue telling me about thirst traps. Yeah, so um, <laughs> oh, these really, really successful thirst traps um, of Pedro Pascal, there's just one creator who does them real well, and once that SNL skit... Oh! Spiders, I hate spiders. Spiders are the worst. <laughs> um, are you okay? <laughs> you great. So okay. good. Every time Timothy pops out, I feel worse about putting spiders in the background for Halloween. Um, in any case. Yeah, sorry. This is this is totally a focused conversation that we're having right now. It's extremely focused. Um, this one creator got tagged a lot when the SNL skit hit TikTok. Um, and I think we should hire that person to make thirst traps of Peepa 2. <laughs> okay, okay. I was wondering where that was going. Thirst traps of... <laughs> William Afton, what? <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be pretty good, too. Oh, my gosh. You've heard of spring trap. Now try thirst trap, Bestie. <laughs> Sometimes I'd be counting doors, talking about Pedro Pascal, <laughs> and watching out for ambush. I understand if Pedro Pascal clouds your Ooh. focus. Ooh. Ooh. The courtyard. The lore yard. Oh, cool. Yes. I love this room. And by room, I mean it's not really a room. This space. This, oh, this feels like a place where there should be all sorts of lore. Yeah. I was also going to say this looks like a place that would be in a Barbie movie. <laughs> because the animation is so, like, po polygonal. <laughs> all, the po all the, like, very chunky polygons. <laughs> this fits the aesthetic, sure. Uh, also, I don't know, just, like, the layout. It gives to me. It does it. Yeah. What is there a specific era of Barbie movie that this is uh, summoning to mind? Uh, late nineties, early two thousand. Oh, the For best sure. era. Sure. Yeah. Hey. Hello. Hello, angel figure, guiding light, as our theories go. Hmm. What is the light that's reflecting off of me? Uh. Right? Isn't that weird? Anyone notice this? This is, the, this is a weird little lore detail. I don't know if it matters at all or what, but the fact that we are just a hovering light is kind of interesting. Because my, my, my uh, lighter isn't flicked on. So what, what is the light that's emanating from me? It must be the luster of your... Uh, Gleaming smile. Uh, yes. It's true. My shiny teeth in me. Also, oh, I guess it's his arms. I was going to say, for a second Ooh. it looked like the cheese wheel with a sword. Not quite, though. All right. So that's the lore. Law. That's the lore. Thanks, everyone, for joining us. The lore. For the lore rooms. Let's move on, shall we? The lore rooms. Ten left. Oh, man. We'd be flying. Pressure's on. Ninety. Lampshades. Ooh! 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 Ooh, this be a spooky room. Oh, what the heck? What the, what the heck? What? What? Ho! What? Ho! 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 There's goo! Uh, there be evil goo! Uh, what? Oh, wow! Oh, jeez! Oh, jeez! Oh, jeez! There's a lot going on right now. There's evil goo on the ground? Like, evil goo trap? Oh my gosh! Stop it! What the heck? Is it like weird, like teeth or like what? What it's is got, like, that? Right, it's it's one part teeth, but then there's 
Is it like coming out of the ground in random spots? Or is it like actually marked? Because we see a mark afterwards, but like... Right. Oh, ran out of fuel. Not great, not great. So we're in like the, the man-eating plant room, obviously. I hated that room. That room sucked. <laughs> okay, nice. there. Look, I see it. So that that oh. would be a goo trap right there. A little gooer. Oh! 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 Oh, they're not messing around right now. This is This is this has gotten really intense. This is scary, Matt. Oh my god. This is oh and there's the uh, the eyeball guy over there. Oh no. Shoot. Oh this is This is crazy. Okay. So I gotta avoid the things on the floor. Avoid the things on the floor. Watch out for Anyone be chasing me? Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, God. It's, and it's so dark, and I have nothing. Oh, this is crazy. End game. End game of doors. Not messing around. Oh, this is great. Also, what's up with all the? Oh shoot! Uh, where yeah, but <laughs> what's up with all these like weird plant experiments that are going on right now? Lore. Right. I, it feels like there's some mysterious stuff going on. I wonder what type of plants these are. Like, looks like um, tulips, daisies, and I don't know what the purple. What those other guys? I kind of generic looking flowers, but. You know what they say, can't spell flora without Laura. <laughs> yeah, that's what that is what they say? <laughs> they say that all the time. Okay, hey, thanks Guiding Light. I like it when you guide me. Oh, oh, oh not, not again. Oh, no. Uh. See you. Okay, so the green plant is clearly uh, recovering my health, which is wonderful. <laughs> Thank you, green plant. 95. Oh, wow, this is this is tense. I am very nervous. I'm nervous okay. for it. Also, they are out in force right now. Every room has at least like two. Oh god. <laughs> it's just an onslaught as you slowly inch your way through these through these rooms. Two. Through the two lips. Yes. With me. <laughs> oh, Oofa. bitch. Chomped. <laughs> Ch chomped. All right, not great. Not great. All right, so there's that. Presumably, presumably it's on the other side. Any goo? Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Hey, bud. Stay calm. 96. Ninety-six. Ninety-seven. Ooh. These last ten. Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? You gotta give me a little bit more time than that, man. Yeah, I'm in a, In the greenhouse, there are no lights that can flicker. Yeah! No doubt. There's still sound cues. Which you did not give me. Yes, I know! I know! <laughs> Come on! <gasps> oh, God! Oh, no. Oh. I was... I was doing so well. Oh, Matt, I'm so sorry. Damn it. <sighs> really? And you can still only revive once? I get it. I get it, game. You need, you need your microtransacts. I get it. That, again, 
I feel like that was a cheap death. For as much as some of these moments where I'm like, oh, they've really polished up moments of the game and I feel much more in control, that was a cheap death. I got no warning auditorially from that. Because I had been hearing it every other time. And just because I'm in a pitch dark room, look, I, I was looking. Ah! Oh no! All right. That's really rough. Well, we were so close. Whoo! All right, we're at the 90. Oh my right. gosh. Ah. I got my cross at least. You sure do. And a little bit of a flashlight. <laughs> Great. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks so much. Thanks so much. I understand why the cross, but I think it'd be really funny if there if you were given other items and objects that were known to deter. Wait. <laughs> the, the point of the eyeballs is not to look at the eyeballs. Screech. Okay, listen listen for Holt. Or not Holt. Listen for Rush. I bet. Ninety-two. Ninety. The greenhouse. Ninety four. came in late. That came in super late, right? Yeah. You only had a few seconds from the game audio to that, and I couldn't even tell because of the rain. Right? There's so much ambience. 95. But you do have the crucifix to protect you, which is a win. See a thing, man. Nope, wrong one. Screech. That was Screech. We had home slice. Are you just trolling me now? You might have deterred him by going in the wardrobe. I'm not sure. Oh! <laughs> Awful. <laughs> I'm just waiting for him to make another rush at me. Ninety-seven. Oh, I hear something. Yep. Oh. Oh. It takes a sweet time, man. Oh, I knocked out my my guiding light. Oh man, this is so tense. I hear him. Is that him? I hear the a sound. But that's the sound of like entering a new door, isn't it? It's so hard to tell. It really is. I don't want to use the cross if I don't have to. All right, I guess I gotta go for it, huh? Oh, 
Oh my gosh, I really can't tell if it's him or not. It's so hard. Right? Because of the wind. It's Cause of the like, wind. Ugh. Also, this room hasn't gotten its second yet. Oof. 99. Oh. Ooh, hey. Oh my gosh. Oh my. 99. Woo. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Oh my goodness. 100. Hello. Hello. Oh, what is this? What do we got going on here? Ooh, medical supply? Like, like factory barrels? Oh, crazy. So is this a whole, is this actually a hotel? What is this? It's like we're doing weird experiments in some way. Weird, weird. Okay. Weird experiments. This is crazy. Oh, okay, so last time the figure attacked us. Ooh, ooh, look, 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 look. It's like meat. <laughs> that, no, no, it supports the idea that we had, the theory that we had, that they're building homunculi or that they're, they're experimenting with creating life, which is how you get the figure. Oh, oops. Wait, did you hear what? Psst, psst. I heard it. Psst. Did you? I did. Okay, I'm very concerned about that. Not great. High voltage. Can I open this? Need a key. Oh yeah, Ew, it's, it's all the flies around. It yeah, is gross. it's rotting meat. Oh, yeah. it's rotting meat. It's crazy. Ew. Okay, so he's. I'm assuming because there's a bunch of cabinets here, he's gonna attack us like he did before, where we died at floor 100. Yes. But now we have a special friend. The cross? Yeah. Is the cross able to work on the figure? I I thought it was... I mean, I assume it's able to take down anything. <laughs> I assume nothing. Ooh, what is this in the air, too? You see all the, like, texture in the air? It's like spores. Particulate. Oh, it's the last of us! It's gonna turn us into fungi zombies! Do you think we're gonna meet Pedro Pascal? No, oh, I hear he's a thirst trap! <laughs> Love him! He's all over my TikTok these days. Did you know that? <laughs> really? All right. all right, I'm stalling. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Run away, run away. Run away. Ah! Ooh! Ooh, I can go straight? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, hey, hey, what's Woo! that doing? Is that killing him? Is that just stalling? What, what's going on here? Am I stuck here? What's going on? No! No! Are you kidding me? Oh my god, no! And he was blocking me! Oh, get out of here! <gasps> Don't introduce all these mechanics at the end! No! Oh. Oh. No! <laughs> I was, I, for a second there, I'm like, oh, I need to get around him, but I was stuck in... There was a closet on one side and him on the other. Oh, 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 ouchie. Oh, oh, ouchie. <laughs> well, I'm glad I continued my life because it got me to 100. Well. <sighs> That, that, wow. Wow. Are, are you okay, Matt? No. <laughs> no. No, I'm not. I'm not okay. I want to say I'm okay, but I'm not. Because here's the thing, uh -huh. Ash. Yeah, yeah. I was mentally... I'm sure the internet is like dying right now, and I don't know, if, uh, I'm sure a handful of you are frustrated. Trust me, I'm frustrated. Because here's the thing, I had the cross, Yep. but I was also re I didn't expect it to do anything. And so I was ready and waiting for the heartbeat thing. And so the heartbeat, I was ready, and I was ready to play the heartbeat game. I was mentally prepared for that. 
but then all of a sudden the cross goes off the heartbeat things going on i'm getting like four different things happening at once and all of a sudden i'm seeing that he's frozen and i the closet is open all of a sudden and so and I'm like, oh, and suddenly it connects in my gamer brain of like, no, he's only frozen here temporarily. I need to get out. But then he's blocking the way that I can get out. Because he's blocking this narrow hallway. The closet's blocking the other side. I was a victim of like the worst confluence of things all happening at the same time. <laughs> all of it. All of it hitting me all at once. All of it. You really couldn't run backwards? No, I, I could have run. I'd like, here's the thing. By the time I could have run, I'd like, in the... <laughs> think about it this way. Yes, I'm... Good. I'm going to go to the closet. Yeah. I'm going to play the heart mini game. Yep. Oh, wait. My cross has opened up the cabinet and it's firing off and he's frozen here. Yes. It's not destroying him, though. So then the thought process is, okay, what do I do here? Okay, it's, he's not being destroyed. I need to run away from him. Let me try to sneak past him. Oh wait, I can't sneak past him because the hallway is blocked. And now he's coming alive again. So that was the thought process mm. that I was dealing with. Yeah. And by the time I had done the four or five steps to, I need to get out of here right now. My former hiding spot is no longer valid. Mm -hmm. He was awake. Yeah, that's rough, buddy. Oh. Oh, door 100! <laughs> I can never get through door 100! All right. I wish this game had, like, <laughs> checkpoints. Right? Come on. So I you get could, it. Because like, it's so hard to practice door 100 if you struggle bus and it takes so long to get there. Or, or I mean, even, or even practice... Like, here's the thing. I could practice the Heartbeat game on 50, but that's still 50 f doors. That's still like a decent amount of gameplay to get to a thing where it's like, okay, I'm going to summon him over so that way I can practice the art we made in the game. Like, the problem, and exactly to your point, it's, it's all about practice. The problem is that there are so many mechanics that are being thrown at you at 100. Yes. Because if you play 50 the way you're supposed to play 50, you should not have to encounter any of this. Yes. You shouldn't. He, you, he shouldn't be chasing you. You shouldn't be playing a heartbeat mini game. You shouldn't be hiding in wardrobes. None of that should happen. Which means that hundred, when suddenly you are forced to do those things, you're suddenly like, I don't know what to do. You're you're being confronted with so many new variables, all on the level where the stakes are the highest. And don't get me wrong. They know this. I'm almost pot. Like I think they're aware. So that way. You, one more run, one more run. Let me let me revive. I get it. Oh, but man. Oh. Because yeah, to this day, I still haven't gotten a chance to really practice. Hard. I got confronted with the heartbeat minigame one time. Yep. When we got to door 100. Mm -hmm. The first time we played this game. Yes. I died to it because I'm like, ah, what? Because also they give you a prep. That's the other thing, too. And And this is just me talking about game design at this point. But they also give you this moment of like, you're getting the tutorial at the top. So at first I'm like, oh, I'm playing the game. Let me let me press the buttons when I saw them going. But it's like, oh wait, no, down. And then all of a sudden the ones down are the ones that actually matter. So that was another layer of like, wait, which one is the heartbeat mini game? <sighs> yeah. And so then you're figuring that out. <laughs> you're getting emotional, Matt. It's okay. <laughs> oh no. <sighs> <sighs> well, I did say at the end of the last upload that we would get to door 100. And I would we say, sure I, did. I said door 100. And I'm glad that I can... Because I was thinking about quitting the life. I'm like, okay, if our goal is to get to A000 again, let me just quit the life and restart. But I'm glad I'm like... But I'm like, I paid for that life game. I paid for it, so I'm going to see it through. And I'm glad I did, because it got to me to 100. Now I know when we get here again what to do. But man, those final 10 floors are so scary. The pressure is so high. All right. I'm going to continue this on a different day because I've been playing this for a while and I need to record other stuff today. But um, the, 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 the upload isn't over. Just the day of me recording doors is over. I come back to open more doors on another day. <sighs> so in the meantime, bottoms up. Wish me luck. <laughs>
Jeez. Ah! Oh, doors! Haunts me! It'll never end. It won't. We're so close. All right. See you on the other side of whatever smash cut Ash puts here. Make it fun. Make it spicy. Okay, cool. Cool. I'll do something no one expects. Great. 53. So, okay, so what am I looking out for now? Uh. You said it's floor 60? Door 60? Mm -hmm. I always say floor. Floor 60, yes. Door 60, I believe, is where the secrets are. Okay. So we'll aim for that then. Door 60 has lore. Door lore. Oh, I love door lore. The spiciest kind of lore. I don't have anything that requires batteries. Fantastic. It's, it's hidden, so... Door lore. Right, I was gonna say, so... Where is it hidden? <laughs> like, because when you're like, oh, there's there's lore in this room, I I feel like, you know, we're not superficially passing through rooms. You know, it's not like... You know, I, I feel in my heart that if you look for it, yeah. you will find it. Really? Okay. Yes. So I'm just not doing a good enough job of searching. No, I wouldn't go... I wouldn't say that. I would say it's an unusual situation. Okay, it's bad. Great. 56! I mean, there's a lot of suspicious bookcases and things. Like, I will say, there's a lot of suspicious bookcases and things. Lingering around. 57. Fifty-eight. You said sixty. Sixty. Okay. Yes. And this is based off of what the comments of part one told us. Then no. So. Waiting for it. Not. I'm not dying to you, Rush. The lights flickered. The lights flickered. Are you, are you trolling me right now? You'd be trolling? I think you'd be trolling. Because those lights do be flickering. 59. See? 60. Okay, 60. Got this map. Also, is it? It's just interesting that I thought everything was randomized. Oh, oh, is this it? Is this? Oh, going in between the walls. Oh, cool. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, we're exploring the walls, in the doors, in the hotel. Any one of these singular words could function as its own game title. Ooh. No way! Oh, crazy. Okay. This painting doesn't seem to have a title. Suspicious! Suspicious! Indeed. Oh, so much lo- wait. Hmm. Can I get through here? Do I need to... I mean, on one hand, I'm like, oh, maybe there's something in one of these? That doesn't seem right, though. That would be odd. That's a... Do I need to fire off a switch in a different room? Or, like, in the walls, maybe? Hmm. Hmm. I don't want to proceed too far, though. Huh. Okay. It is weird for them to say like, hey, here's here's a thing though. Oh, but look at the ominous glow. Look at that yellow wall. It's like we're entering the back rooms. <laughs> Finally, the clap that we've known has been coming. At long last. It's, it, we've known it's been gonna happen, but now it's finally here. 
I'll give it seriously. Uh, I'm assuming, okay, Ash, do you know this? If I proceed forward and flip a switch somewhere, or somewhere is it somewhere in door 60? Or is it beyond? Well, let me see what the friendos say. <laughs> I like that you don't know, do you? Ah, okay. My guess is that there's either a switch somewhere in this room, ooh, hold on. or there's a switch in uh, like the adjacent room that I need to, to throw. Interesting. <laughs> Great. Might be worth exploring that. Okay, thanks, Ash. <laughs> Here, th thank you. Okay, I'm trying to let you do the things. Yeah, sure, but also I've been doing the things for a while now. Oh, God. Where are you at? Where are you at? <laughs> I've been doing- oh, hey, this is one of those rooms with the switch. Okay, this is it. That was... Okay, so this is a switch room. So yes, I'm gonna say that there's a switch here that I'm gonna need to throw. And then go back. Go back to the- there it is. Okay, throw this. Ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. Okay, so now that is either shut me out of it or it's let me enter it. That's my guess. Where are we at? Okay, here we go. There's that one. Nope, we didn't need to go in any of those. Come on, the lore! Okay, so that's forward, but I want to go back. To the rooms! Okay, so here. Oh, game changer. Yeah, right. It's almost like having light in this game makes a big difference. What? Okay, Are you serious? did it open? Yes! There you go, Matt. Oh, buddy! Go oh, secret rooms! In the doors! Yes. And they're yellow. And they're yellow! Oh, no. A000? Yes. Oh. No! We need lock picks! That I lost when the figure in inadvertently killed me! Oh. No! Oh. And I couldn't buy more! Yeah, there was no way for you to get more. Oh. I had three, at least! Oh. And you need two! You need, you need two of them. You need them. two and the skeleton key. Oh, I want you so badly! Door lore! Oh, this game. This game keeps kicking me when I'm down. <laughs> this is brutal. The figure that was, oh, now I'm salty about that unwarranted. Before I was zen about the unwarranted death where I'm like, I didn't deserve that death, but I'll, I'll stomach it. That's fine. Because all I'm aiming for is door 60. Like, if, if I was aiming for door 100, I would have been saltier about that figure death. Because I'm like, ah, but door 60, I'm like, oh, I can get to door 60, no problem. But now to know that it stole away my lockpicks. And that I needed those. Oh. No. Oh, no. All right. Well, there's going to be a part three to this, I guess. <laughs> Yay. A part three to this where we get to, we're going to do both. Both? Door 100 and I, 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 I and whatever this is. Sweet cheese. Man. It'll be, it'll be, I don't know. Well, <laughs> I say that, I say that, but I also sit here knowing that this game can sometimes take a long time to reset because when you die you're reset all the way back to zero right so it requires me to get through some sometimes janky like ah i died on that one so okay but that's the goal okay. next time we're gonna do at least one of these things if not both it would be my goal to do both but you know sometimes fate intervenes but i want to do god doris keeps pulling me back the door's curse continues. The door's, this game is cursed for us. But here's the thing, it's always part two. It's always part cursed. two. It's always part two. Door, for those of you who don't know what we're talking about, go watch our initial Doors playthrough, where part one was us getting the lay of the land. Part two, cursed. Yeah. Most cursed. It Truly, it was like... Cursed. How we, many recording sessions went into part two? Four. I think it was four. Yeah, it was, it was really bad. And now, here we are, recording two. <sighs> yeah, I guess so. Damn, damn. I know. 
two. And both times, both times were not on us. I don't think. That whole, <laughs> I, st- I still think that that rush at the end of door number seven, 97, not my fault. Yeah. There was no audio cue. You were robbed. I was so robbed of that one. This one, uh, the figure, I, I don't know how he heard me half a room array. Just saying. I'm not, I don't like being that guy who blames the game, but sometimes I'm like, I think this is the game. Ah. <laughs> oh! Okay, next time, what is behind door A000? More lore. Oh, I'm so hyped! Woo! Keeps pulling me back, doors! You frustrate me to no end, but you keep pulling me back, so join me next time as we uncover at least one of these mysteries. I think I'm gonna start with A000, because door 100, I could just look up someone else's, honestly. But I'm curious about this one. So, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for putting up with a cursed upload, upload number two. We got hints at stuff but next time it all comes together so thank you so much for watching we'll see you in the next video and as always remember it wasn't a live stream but it was a video a video for you see ya